This is a Harrison Teach Lathe model Alpha 550 plus. It's a 21 inch swing by 80 inch centers. It's got a Fanuc Alpha control. You can see here the serial number A5463. Machine is new in 1997. That's your spindle hole right there. It's got a big Alora's tool post on it. Nice big Pratt burner chuck. Three jaw. It's a removable gap. And we're going to jog it around for you a little bit. Angel's moving, moving it by, both by rapid traverse and by the pulse generator. That's the rapid. Oh, he's moving the, the cross slide. You can see that the waves are very nice condition. He's moving that by a pulse generator. Move that again by a pulse generator. He's moving that by a pulse generator. You can see he's moving the hand wheel. Great. It's got Jacob's chuck in the tail stock as well, as you can see. That's your spindle. You turned it on. That's the low range right there. 140. 140. Okay. Let's gonna put it into a higher range now. There are three ranges up to 1800 RPM. This is the middle range. Four twenty-five. This is original paint, by the way. This is uh, you can see it hasn't been used a whole lot. I mean, these these ways are in very smooth, no scoring. This is the high range. over a thousand rpm so 1100 rpm right now i'm going to go over there and show that 1100 rpm and it's i mean i'm standing right up next to it it's a very quiet machine top speed of, of the machine is 1800 rpm that's 1500 i think that's fast enough okay <laughs> Over 1600 is going. 1560. 1700 right now. Okay, that's good enough. And that's the spindle brake. Okay. That's the reverse. See? Yep, so we did forward, reverse. High, low, and medium range. You saw the uh, carriage move from left to right and the cross slide front and back. You saw the ways. This is the tail stock. Angel, want to move the tail stock a little bit? The, uh, the quill. He's moving the quill. And sliding in and out. There you go. Okay, thank you very much for watching the video.